What's up guys, I'm Phoenix Master one and welcome back for some more Fire Mom Heroes. So we pretty much got the confirmation that uh, we're going to be getting Book 5 soon along with the Faye channel because this month's update announcement has absolutely nothing except for the Weapon Refinery announcement. So yeah, we're probably going to be getting it pretty soon. So I'm pretty excited about that and we already know that we're going to be going to Nidavellir as the next realm and that is the realm of dwarfs. So I'm hoping that we could get some really, really good uh, free unit out of that. I'm not really too sure if they're going to be giving us a light mythic like they did for book 3 and 4. Um, they could give us an astro mythic, but I'm not really too sure uh, it, like if they want to give us free mythics at this point. And they might just give us like simple unit without any kind of legendary or mythic status. Or even a dual unit actually, our first free dual unit. That would be something and I would really really like that. And the thing is that we don't have any kind of ephemera information as well for the next update. So I'm not really too sure what they get out of not showing that here. Um, it might be that we're getting some special ephemeras for December. Might be something related to that because I thought they would reveal at least the ephemera information here. So let me know in the comments what are your expectations out of book 5 and the free unit. And I'm personally expecting some quality of life changes just to make the UI a bit more convenient. And Hero Merit cap should be increased. It has been a long time since it was last increased, so that would be really good. And more ways of getting dragon flowers would also be pretty nice. And we should be able to farm uh, trade fruits. Not like literally farm, but I mean like uh, use the Ether Resort to basically get trade fruits, I guess. Kind of like how we could get dragon flowers, if it makes sense. And uh, I really hope that they could give. You know, weapon refines to the early legendary heroes like Legendary Lin, Fee Arm, stuff like that. And even like distant counter weapon refines to I, Camus, Black Knight, and all of those units. You know, it's been a long time since they have given like mass weapon refines. So, Book 5 would be a really, really good place to do that, in my personal opinion. Would definitely, uh, you know, excite many players who have invested into those units. So, those are just my expectations, but I know I'm probably expecting way too much. Um, but still just wanted to go over them and now let's move on to the weapon refinery part uh, for this update So we're getting a seal falchion weapon refine which is gonna be given to four units because they all share that weapon uh, Yeah, good old times when units used to get alternate preferred weapons They don't do that anymore but because they realize that it devalues the original unit who had that weapon So we haven't really got any kind of recent units who got alternate preferred weapons so Let's start with uh, Horse Crom. He's not particularly a very um, impressive unit at this moment. He's uh, kind of mediocre. He isn't really very bulky. He isn't really very fast. And he doesn't really hit very hard. So they could try to give him like a solo condition because he's a horse unit. So that could be something. But I'm hoping like Seal Falchion Refine is really, really good because Horse Crom is a five star locked unit. And by association, you know, other units could also take advantage of that and even better um, because they will have access to the infantry only skills. So stuff like normal Lucina who just got your splendid version would see new life as a unit. Especially Mass Marth because a lot of people have built her up to plus 10 because we were given like so many free copies of her that it didn't really take too many grails or feathers to plus and merge her. So many people just have her at plus and merge. So Seal Falchion is going to be really really amazing. And I was always of the belief that Seal Falchion was you know, just better weapon than even the Falchion Weapon Refine because I'm not the greatest fan of Bonds in 2020. They're really hard to position, especially in player phase. If they were like up to two spaces away from the unit, that would be really good. But you have to be literally adjacent to the unit. So I just kind of prefer Seal Falchion a bit more than Falchion Weapon Refine. So I hope Seal Falchion could be really good. And at last, you know, Chrom is going to be getting that as well. Um, but uh, there's less hope for normal Chrom, in my personal opinion than Mass Lucina or Normal Lucina because uh, both of them are really really fast so they could just get more out of it in my opinion but would be nice if this is a really really solid weapon refine. Novi finally is also getting a weapon refine and kind of like how Faye got a pretty nice weapon refine. I hope that she also gets the same treatment because a lot of people have built her up at plus 10 merge. Uh, back from the early days when you know dragon units were really really good so I hope that you could have a preferred disencounter weapon refine because Fate did maintain the light breath type of condition from her 
base effect. So I'm hoping they carry over the base effect of Lightning Breath, you know, just cut out the penalty to the special cooldown and give her something extra. And even if, she, you know, if she's not going to be getting a distant counter preferred breath, um, I hope that she gets a nice offensive breath because at the end of the day, you could run distant counter in Slade. And if it's something really, really unique in her weapon, that would be really good as well. So either way, both of the things will be really good. And Fae Weapon Refine in general has given a lot of Novi users hope that this purifying breath is going to be a pretty nice weapon then we have got mist as the healer refine of uh december i really wish they could give like healers you know refines in bulk it's not really all that hard come on there are just so many healers it will be end of 2021 and still all of the book one and book two healers will not have gotten their weapon refines so it's a really slow process and it's not something that is needed honestly at this point because there are many healers like Mist who need it. So Mist is a 5 star locked healer. Um, back in the days when uh, Mist was still in the normal summoning pool. Even now she is but only for the you know revival banners. But back when she was in the normal summoning pool. She was really really notorious for pity breaking in the colorless. Many people have got her from those times. So I hope that uh, you know Elena's staff is a really really busted weapon and weapon refine she is probably going to be having the slow effect as the base effect um but i hope it could be something even better because miss doesn't have very impressive stat line at all the only thing that she has got is resistance she's got pretty underwhelming attack speed defense um hp is a bit better than most of the healers but nothing really too impressive so i hope this can be a really busted weapon refine i hope because mist is one of those units that if you got pity broken by you felt super bad because she wasn't really that good so it's time to reward all of those people who have painful memories of getting pity broken by mist when they were trying to get some other unit in the colorless pool um just on that and at last we have got oliver didn't expect him to get weapon refined before Joshua, Leon, all of these other popular uh, Grail units. But here he is with his weapon refine, um, Tome of Favors. So Oliver is the kind of defensive mage and I'm hoping that he could get like a conditional close counter. And of course that would be a really big blow to a lot of people who have inherited close counter on his slotty. And close counter or close file is basically his best slotty skill if you're using him at high investment. Uh, because he does have better physical bulk than most of the mages. So you know something like that could be nice because he could run like tier 3 stand skills on his slotty if it's like a conditional close counter similar to Bowie's. And a tier 3 like stand skill is so good for him because he's so slow he could prevent the special acceleration of the foes so that could be something um but instead of giving him close counter they could also just focus on giving him more bulk he is a free unit but i hope he could get like a decent weapon refine because i have seen some of uh very loyal <laughs> oliver users with plus and merges so i know they will definitely appreciate that so that's pretty much the weapon refinery this time around um this should be like the weapon refinery standard for all of the all of the updates in my opinion like seven six or seven units getting the weapon refine here seal falchion is shared by four units so that's why we see more units on the on the promotional art that's the one thing that i really want you know weapon refines that are fast because we still aren't done with gen 1 units and it's gonna be a long time until many of the healers get the weapon refines so let me know in the comments if you're gonna be looking forward to any of these weapon refines and what do you expect out of the free hero of book 5 and i want to thank all of my youtube members for their constant support if you enjoyed then please be sure to leave a like and a comment helps me tremendously and be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell because YouTube sub boxes are about as slow as Oliver. So with that said, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.